Hey, what's up, guys? Sniper Nick here, and today we're gonna go over a quick recap of our watch list for tomorrow morning, which is Wednesday, October 9th. All right, let's go ahead and dive right in. All right, so check this out, guys. So this screen is our watch list screen. We post the watch list every single weekday for the next morning. There are a lot of stocks when you're trading these penny stocks. You'd be surprised. There's hot ones every single day. So what's cool is we set up a watch list. We sit back at the end of the day. That way we got some hot stocks that were moving yesterday and also some potential for the next morning. All right, so let's check this out. Let's go ahead, let's dive right in. We're gonna talk about, like I said, our watch list for Wednesday, October 9th. And interesting enough, before we dive in, if you look back on the watch list for Tuesday, October 8th, we have the same stock at the top. It looks like something could have hit. Let's check out what happened. All right, and here's how we started. Watch list Wednesday, October 9th. CLSI, 35% gain from yesterday. So super nice, 35% gain from the list yesterday. Uh, CLSI, as you can see, it was on the watch list yesterday. Had a nice first green day, which ended up turning to an all-time high breakout this morning. This one was on the radar yesterday. It was on the watch list as well, that morning watch list after created that uh, first green day. Let's go ahead and let's dive into the play now. So check this out. So this is CLSI. This is its view from the one year. We, so we had CLSI on the watch list from the morning, from this day. And then I'm continuing, and this is today. This candle represents today. And look at this nice push from 9.6 all the way to 11.7. So look at that potential here, and that's intraday. So let's go ahead and let's dive into now the one day, one minute chart of CLSI. All right, so here it is, one day, one minute. Look at this morning. For this morning, just this morning, it was at 7.28, so down here in the bottom sevens, ended up topping out all the way up here to 11.7. About 35%, I think that's even more, around 40% gains. So 40% potential. So that just shows the huge potential in these plays. And that's right here, just in the morning. So super nice CLSI. Uh, and as we break down in the watch list, it ends up getting a shakeout. Uh, you know, it opened the morning with a shakeout, but once it made a bottom, it started to gravitate towards all time high. After that initial dip, it made higher lows in the next two dips to reach its all time high of 965. And so let's let's zoom in on this and let's give a breakdown here. We get the shakeout. And then check this out. It pops back and regains VWAP. Okay? After it regains VWAP, it makes that new high. Great bullish sign. So after it makes a new high, of course it's gonna take a dip. We don't expect it to go all the way up uh, to its 52 week high, uh, but it did have a first green day. We're watching it. Check this out. After its first dip, it holds, it holds VWAP as well. It makes a higher low and it continues to push. And now this next one tops out at 9.3, which is not exactly at 9.65. So ideally we kind of want it to simmer and, and come back up for that sweet, our sweet play of it coming back up and building up for, for, the, for the PM. Uh, but check this out. This shows big potential in the morning with that second dip holding VWAP and also making a higher low. And then when it makes that new high is when it actually makes that push and uh, it ends up pushing from that 9.6 spot or even from that 9.3 high to, uh, to top out in the next two minutes at 10.3. So already right there is 10%. So a 10% gain in the matter of three minutes, uh, that just shows big potential in the micro side of things. Uh, zooming out a little bit, you know, it ended up topping out at 11.7. So that's, again, around a 40% gain. We stay away midday. Statistically, we don't have any consistency ourselves trading our strategy uh, midday. So we stayed away, did top out here. Uh, however, it holds and it creates a little bit of a support. So that's good to see. Uh, what's nice to see is uh, on top of that support that it created, even though it cracks this support uh, in the last 40 minutes, or in the last 20 minutes, it still is holding its breakout of 9.6. So that 9.6, 9.65 spot is key. We're gonna be watching that spot tomorrow. Ideally, it holds that. Uh, it also has support here at 9.3. Uh, hopefully it holds for a potential continuation. Uh, the next resistances, as you can see here, is 10.67 and 11.7. So let's see, let's see if CLSI could, could get moving again. But that was a nice game. Again, congrats. Uh, on the team there that nailed it. 
Uh, LVCA, the next one. It's a sub penny that turned into a penny that had a huge two days and ended up reaching its all time high today of 0 0.064. Quick breakdown of this one. It hadn't seen much liquidity for us uh, to be su super interested in playing this. However, we're keeping a hot eye on it because it is now hovering around its all time high. So let's check out LVCA. You know, if you've been following us for a little bit, you know that we like to dabble in these sub pennies uh, because they offer huge potential. Now, high risk with these sub pennies, but check this out. Um, you know, three huge days and it's going all the way from under a penny 0 0.008 to now reaching its all time high of 0 0.064. I don't even know the gains there. Now, it, like I said, it is hovering around this high, so let's see. Um, zoom into the one day, one minute, very liquid. We're staying patient on these ones. We want the, the sub pennies really to, to be, have concrete minute candles and you'll see that. You'll, you'll be gifted with that if you're patient enough and you hang out around enough um, that you'll get an ideal situation where it'll look like just a normal OTC uh, penny stock and you'll be able to trade it with these sub pennies. They're so fresh that the breakouts end up pushing even more. Um, so we'll still watch this, however, because it, it is hanging around its all-time high. Uh, it did break that all-time high of six yesterday, and now it's hovering around that 6-4 spot. So let's see tomorrow. Uh, it did create some support at 5-6, so if it gains that, regains that spot tomorrow, maybe it creates some more support there. Uh, even if it's a liquid, if it creates some more support for a couple days, we'll keep an eye. See if it continues past that 6-4. No news yet, so maybe it gets an article. So that's something that we're keeping on the watch list. Uh, next one, another sub penny play. Another sub penny play, GOVX. Again, another one we stayed away from because as you can see with the one minute, it was a little choppy. However, check this out. This one on the long-term chart is coming down off its all-time lows here. And really, it can't get too much lower than this, but it's been seeing volume these past two days. So, skeptical one to look at for now. However, we're keeping an eye on it because these sub pennies lately have had multi day runners. And as you can see, last time it actually got a green day, it did have that three day run up. So, let's see. Maybe this one could get back to that special spot of that penny land, uh, which seems to be interesting when these sub pennies get back there. They, they tend to have uh, some volatility around that spot. So, let's see. And that also is. Uh, multi-month resistance here so GOVX let's see what, what you can do if you can uh, get some volume again before we move on look at the one day one minute again you want to see better candles uh, however when we did have a super small account we had success trading our plays you know with these sub penny setups uh, again high risk so we were going super light uh, but high reward uh, the gains could be huge as you could see with that last one the one with, with an L, it uh, went from the 0 .008 to six cents. So let's see, we'll keep an eye on GOVX. And then lastly guys, we'll wrap it up. This is actually a listed play. Uh, the top three were OTCs. This last one will be our listed play of the day. Again guys, it was for us, uh, there wasn't really anything that ideally lined up with what we love to see. Uh, CLSI, that was a nice play from yesterday's watch list. However, it was, a, it, was a, it was a very light day. There was some interesting news going on with China. Uh, they're taking out the NBA. Uh, Trump been going back and forth with them. So things have been getting interesting in the market. Let's just zone in on this last play, which is the last listed one, NNA. Again, it's a listed low float, lower float. Uh, however, do a little bit of research into this one. I went on to uh, Wall Street Journal and their shares outstanding is 13 million. However, their public float is larger, which doesn't make sense uh, because their public float is supposed to be smaller than that shares outstanding. It can't be larger. Um, so we're going to keep an eye on this. Either way, it's an overextended play. So the bottom line, it's overextended. Uh, it's a 52 week breakout that it ended up breaking out today. However, on the long term chart, if you look at it, we got an overextended 52 week breakout. And ideally, you know, I want this one to continue again tomorrow. And then on day four or day five, ideally day five, it shows its weakness and we're able to short. And what we what we saw on the long term chart, if you zoom out to actual the, the, the two, three year, um, its next resistance is that two year resistance of 935. So if we could get to that spot on day four or five, we're gonna be watching it around there to see when the weakness could come in. And again, with the stock that has a lot of red candles, uh, you know, really not a lot of range on its candles, so this is abnormal. Uh, if it continues, we see good downside. So we'll be looking again at 935 as a key spot. 
So let's see. All right, guys, that wraps it up, I think, for our watch list. Let's see. Yep, that wraps it up for our watch list for the night. Uh, thanks. If you guys do have any questions or ever want to talk about some stocks, reach out to us. You can always comment below. Slam the like. Let's go. Much love, guys. Sniper Nick out.